Joseph Sun by Indian director Haubang Pabang Kumar made its world premiere on Tuesday. It follows the journey of a man in search of his missing teenage son amid ethnic clashes in Manipur, a state in northeastern India. I watched almost every Indian movie I could find. Many of them are joyful, but this movie puts me in a heavy mood. It's kind of like a documentary. I'm always impressed by the music in Indian films. This one has both guitar and flute, which is very touching. Here comes the Q&A session. I thought most old fans stay for such sessions because many screenings are either a world premiere or being screened outside their country of origin for the first time. It is hard to find trailers or even reviews on such movies. I guess that's what makes such sessions appealing because you can talk to the director and immediately quench your curiosity. There are 35 communities in Manipur and uh, there's a lot of tension among the different communities because of land. Uh, you know, everybody's claiming their own land and forest. So this is a big issue and uh, so I wanted to do a feature film on this. A day earlier, The Chapel by Belgian director and writer Dominique de Rudery was shown to the public at Shanghai Film Art Center. It's a psychological thriller about a young pianist who enters the world-famous Queen Elizabeth piano competition. She soon experiences trauma in the chapel where the competition takes place. Music is international. Music is for everybody. I mean, uh, and especially classical music is something that everybody all over the world can enjoy. So uh, I think this film hopefully will travel well all over in the world. It would be nice to, to win something, but if not, that's okay too. It's already so great to be here. I think the film is a reflection of our real life. The heroine's mother wants to fulfill her own dream by pushing her daughter to win the competition. We're now living in an environment where parents are very anxious, expecting their children to become outstanding. Life is more than a competition. What's most important is that children grow up happy. Both films entered the main competition for Golden Goblet Awards at the 25th Shanghai International Film Festival. One film fan has watched both. I bought tickets for several foreign films this year. They're very realistic. They don't have a fast pace, but the stories are worth pondering on. I have been thinking about yesterday's film and now after this film, I think I will still keep thinking about it tomorrow. Zhang Hong, ICS for CGTN, Shanghai.